Welcome back to GearWire.com. I'm Owen O'Malley. This is the Fender Blacktop Telecaster HH. Uh, HH stands for Humbucker Humbucker. As part of Fender's new blacktop series, relatively new blacktop series, uh, this guitar kind of takes one of uh, the classic Fender body styles and modifies it a little bit, turns it into a guitar more suited towards uh, harder rock, um, uh, metal, heavy metal, although this guitar really can play a, a wide variety of styles. It's just the humbuckers in the blacktop series are overwound Alnico humbuckers, so they're sort of voiced for classic rock but a little bit hotter output. Other features on this guitar include a 22 fret fretboard. Uh, the Tele, Blacktop Tele, is available with a maple neck uh, as well as this rosewood neck. Uh, but it's 22 medium jumbo frets, and the necks are just really, really well made. These guitars, these guitars shred. <laughs> Mother balls. Uh, let's uh, listen again to these pickups clean. And let's uh, at the beginning you heard both of them. Now let's uh, listen to them one at a time. Okay, now let's play it with a little bit of gain, courtesy the DVK hairball. get the idea there. Let's uh, go back to some heavier again. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you can do quite a bit with this guitar, and it's really well made, it's really cool looking. Uh, it's got those sort of black fender skirted amp knobs instead of uh, your typical tele control knobs. Uh, and avid tele fans will notice that the control panel is actually reverse from what the standard tele panel looks like. Yeah, typically the uh, pickup selector is in front of the knobs, uh, but... Uh, it's not on this one. So we did another video on the Fender Blacktop Jaguar, which has uh, very similar electronics, same body wood, alder, uh, same neck wood. A lot of it's the same. The only difference between the guitars is the bridge. This one has this sort of standard saddle bridge, although it is uh, through body stringing. Uh, and it's actually quite a tonal difference from the, uh, the Jaguar. This has a little bit more uh, sort of like telly twang, telly spank to it. Uh, whereas the Jaguar is a slightly more uh, sort of mellow, singy guitar. It just goes to show what difference uh, something as seemingly inconsequential as the bridge design can make uh, to the overall tone of a guitar. Anyway, uh, the Fender Blacktop series of guitars, they all retail for about 
uh, $450, $500, around there. Uh, so fairly uh, affordable guitars, especially considering how good they sound, how well they play, uh, and how cool they look. You've been watching GearWire.com, and I'm Owen O'Malley. I'll see you later.